amazing people. So Jenny here coming to you from Copenhagen, Thailand. Rocking my new glasses that my mom sent me. Okay, they're at, they're not really new, they're actually old. They have like scratches all over them, but I love them and I'm really excited that they're here. And so, hmm, today's a little bit weird. I don't really know what's going on. Last week before I did my visa run, somebody um, told me that I need to leave my room here in Sunrise um, Hostel for the full moon party this month, which is like the 25th, something like that, which is fine, okay, because like they wanted to rent my room out, okay, that's cool, um, but then when they showed me the place, they, somebody else told me I needed to move that day, which was Thursday the 12th, I was like, no, I can't move today, maybe Sunday, but then I didn't move then, and so um, I'm not really sure when I'm supposed to move. And it's a good thing I only have one backpack worth of stuff because it's going to be easy, pack it up and go. And hopefully I'll be finding out some answers to that today. Um, but other than that, I don't know. The sun's shining, so maybe we'll have some fun going to go exploring because I might not get very many more days on this part of the island. Yeah. But first, really terrible instant coffee. Haha. <laughs> So I had to come down into um, Bantai and I was waiting for a taxi and this really nice family stopped and they were like, hey, you know, don't wait for a taxi, just get in. Saw this cute little shy kid. He wouldn't tell me his name, but he's three. And um, then they didn't want me to pay, but I gave them some money anyway, told them to buy ice cream for the kids. Little two-year-old girl. Um, so that was nice. Had a nice chat. It's much better than riding in a, a boring taxi by yourself. So today has been a um, pretty chill day. Came into Bantai for a business meeting, um, which I'm really excited about this new prospect. It all has to do with like focusing on social media, and so that's exciting. I can tell you guys more about it in the future. Can't tell everything now. Um, been hanging out with Levi. She's back there somewhere working. We've been doing a lot of work today. Getting caught up because yesterday I didn't get to work because of the headache thing going on. But I thought now would be a good time to um, just sort of fill you in on my plans coming up. So today is November 18th and I'm leaving Copenhagen like the 12th or 15th of December. So in about a month then I'll be doing like a quick tour around Koh Samui and Koh Tao which are a couple of islands just in the area. In case you haven't figured it out, Koh means island in Thai. And then I'm moving to Chiang Mai up in the north for at least a month, probably two. So I'm very excited about that. And if you have any suggestions about um, where I should go in February, like, you know, in Asia or Southeast Asia area, I'd love to hear them. Love to hear fellow travelers and what you guys have to say. But I also want to tell you that some new and exciting things are coming up on this channel. I have some great ideas up in this noggin and I cannot wait to make the videos for you guys. I'm super excited and I think you're going to love it, so make sure you stay tuned. For people back in Nebraska, those are seashells. They come from this sea. Never fails that we find a dog. Okay, something in the foot. Puppy! 
You're adorable. Is it You're adorable, baby. Oh, he wants attention. Come here. Give you some love. Okay, we've made it our personal mission to find some sticks for these adorable dogs. Hi, buddy. Let's find a stick. Come on. Do you see one? Be cute like you were before. <laughs> huh. Go find a stick. Oh my gosh, that was like a lot of work. Success, but don't throw it in the water. Oh. <laughs> he doesn't know, come on. Where did it go? Here it is. Is this the one you threw? Yeah. Who wants it? Hey, you want it? Who wants it? Ooh, tough guy. Hey, but you, are you a tough guy? Hmm? You're a tough guy? That stick's mm -hmm. bigger than you are. So after all that playing, we are hungry. So I got spicy baby clams that taste like wasabi. I'm not really sure why they have to call them babies though. Yeah. Oh. They don't really look very good. They really don't. Smell that. No, I don't want to smell it. Oh. They just taste like wasabi peas. They oh, don't... like fishy wasabi peas. Okay. Mm -mm. Nope. No. <laughs> We're not doing that. We're not doing more. <laughs> Hi. Good to you. Nam. I shake my knees here. See Nam? Forty pounds here for you. For my shake. Hey, back home. I am not very happy right now. I got picked up by a taxi in Bandai, and he said he'd take me to Hadrin this way. And he drove this way to go pick up more people, which is fine, okay, take 10 minutes. But then I asked him if he's going to Hadrin, and he said, I have to wait for 10 more people, or I can pay three times the regular amount. It's so annoying because I have blonde hair that people think they can take advantage of me here. And it doesn't happen all the time, don't get me wrong, but when it does happen, it's very annoying. So this is a first. Um, he couldn't find anybody to share the taxi, so he kicked me out and told me to find a different one unless I want to pay more. And to be fair, he took me closer to home than I was, but still, how rude. That is insanely rude. I've, I've never, like, I take taxis all the time here and that's never happened. That's the most ridiculous thing ever. Well, that was just ridiculous. I think I sound crankier than I am because I'm hungry, but I found a guy, like, two seconds after the guy dropped me off who, I said, you're going to Hadrin? Yes. 100? Yes, because that's the fare and it was no problem and he took me home and it was not a problem. Like, seriously, it's like three kilometers. 
okay? It's not far. It's not like I'm asking him to drive half an hour. Um, anyway, I did give him a tip because he didn't rip me off, and I really appreciate that. So thank you, taxi driver, and um, I hope more good things come to you because you're a good person. So anyway, guys, I'm home now, and I'm going to eat some supper, maybe watch a little TV and go to sleep. So peace out. Good night. See you tomorrow. And I went and got a kit. I got some Gatorade and uh, pineapple and banana smoothie because I heard those both those, those fruits help take away headaches and some ice cream.